Hey everybody, real quick video here on the uh, great multitude of Revelation chapter 7 verse 9. The Bible says that there would be a great multitude that no man can number. I've thought about that different times and I think, uh, man, it must be a huge amount of people that get saved in the time of Jacob's trouble. Well, there's no another way to look at that. Um, it could be a large number of people, but uh, I don't know. The uh, thing is, um, I think another thing, another way to look at the whole thing is possibly no man can number it because the number's not finished yet. It's kind of like the uh, thing in Matthew chapter 24, verse 36, where it says, you know, no man knoweth the day or the hour of the second coming, essentially. So could it be that Revelation 7, 9 is just simply saying no man can number it in the sense of because it's not finished yet, kind of like no man knows the day or the hour. I don't know. Give me your thoughts on that. I'd like to hear people's opinion on what this great multitude that no man can number, what does that mean? Um, obviously, you know, the the angels that are around about the throne, they're numbered, essentially not to an exact number, but they are numbered. And I just can't imagine that uh, in heaven, no man can number the amount of people that are standing there, even if it's, you know, two or three billion or something, which I don't think would be that many, but that's still a number that you can number. So uh, just kind of a something I was thinking about as I was reading through that passage again, just no man can number this great multitude. I think it's because it's not finished. So let me know your thoughts.